I did 24 hours of Andorial runs, so let's see what I found. So first off, we start off with obviously a Blizzard Toss. I find an Eldritch Orb. This can be plus 3 the skill, so plus 2 is kind of sad. Next drop, Scarab Shell Boots. You want these to be ethereal? They are, that makes me happy. Then, next drop, it's a bloody wind force. Fuck yeah, so that's a wind force. It's a bad one, 6%, but I'll take it. I find an amulet, and this is a cool video, so it's a metal grid. After that, I find a ground charm, and I discover how stupid it is to have to pick up a geed. So what you have to do is you have to put your charm into the shad stash. And then you can pick up the geeds. But it's a perfect one, so I'll take it. Nobody cares about gold find. Or reduced vendor cost. After that, I find some tracks. Those are always cool, very good for killing ubers. I show it to Tamic Mask, and it's like, why would you show this? This is like mid-level shit, but it's a perfect one, so that's why I'm showing it. I find a Storm Shield, this is very nostalgic, not really used anymore, but very nostalgic item, I love Storm Shield. And then I find a jewel, I found a bunch of jewels, but this was a 5-5 one, so I'll take it and show it. After that I found 3 Twisted Essences, I thought that was pretty funny, and an Ohm Rune shows up as well. Always just really fun to find. Then we find a Zakarum Shield, this is a cool shield, like this is for a Holy Fire Paladin, and I just want to build one of those uh, sometime. I want to do a video with like unused items. SOJ shows up as well. After that, it's time for another ring. It's a nature's piece. And there we have the first of our legendary mallets. It's a stone crusher. So Shafers is one of my last grailers. I end up finding a Trangol's belt after that. Very popular item on pit farmers. Then I find a Lich Wand. It's not the most popular item, but this is a very rare item. Same goes for this one. It was one of my last Kralos actually, so the Demon Crossbow, nice to add. And it's followed up by the second Legendary Mallet, so that's another fucking Stone Crusher. And it's followed up by a Faceblade, and come on, this is once again a cool video, so it's an Azure Rod. Then we have the Natalia weapon. And it always has the same stats. And I follow it up with a Vortex Shield, which is Griswold Shield. And then I find a Doombringer, that's also just a very nostalgic weapon for me. I use this a ton in .09. Uh, by the way, this is my gear. This is the Merc's gear. These are my stats. And this is the Nerd Shit Part 1. These are my skills. And back to the farm. So there is another legendary mallet. And it's once again a stone crusher. It's so sad. I have millions of those. And here we have it. The first grailer of the run. This is an unearthed wand. Checking off that's web. After that I found Shaco. And I end up finding a demon head and a vortex shield. So this is Andario's helmet and a Griswold shield. So I have two of the shields now. And it's followed up by a mitral coil, which is a good belt for melee characters. Then I find a set mythical sword, which is the Bulkato sword. This is the one I used to record the BK video. And I end up finding an Arachnids as well. Followed up by a Tall Russia's armor. And after that I find another Eldritch Orb. And this one is plus 3 the skill, so that makes me happy. After that I find some Marowaks, these are plus 2 skills. And another Tal Russia's armor. And the second hand for the Assassin with the second Natalia weapon. I find a giant treasure. And this is just the most useless item in the game, like, what the fuck uses this item? It's so cool. Anyway, next legendary mallet. And once again, it is just a stone crusher. And I find a Maras, plus 26%, and another Trangles belt. Followed up by another amulet. And it's another Maras. So I found those two Maras in the same, like, hour of terror, I saw. And there is an Aries phase, one of my favorite items to find in the entire game. Followed up by another Andario's helmet. 
very good merc helmet or melee helmet. And I find another one of those lich ones. And I find a burr rune. Dun, 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 dun. So sick, such a cool find. And yes, this is the one I used to make the weapon for the summon barbarian. That's this one. So recording this took me like a few months because I needed the terror zones to line up with like my job and shit, so... It took a while. Shaco number two. And I find some matriarchal javelins. Those are thunderstrokes. Third demon head. Another Andarius visage. And yes, one of those became an iron golem. And I find a set Corona, so that's two pieces of the Griswold set. And I find a ring. And ring, 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 it's a nature's piece. And a cryptic axe, please be F and three sockets. It's not, so it's kinda trash. I end up finding another Trangul's belt and a Kraken shell as well. This is a very good mercenary armor. Also casually teleporting through 800 damage and here are the stats for nerds. I have 371 MF and the rest is very fast to read but you can do it if you pause the video. Or I end up finding a dimensional shot which is a death fathom. It's also a grailer. And I find the Caduceus, which makes me have the complete Griswold set. It's also four sockets, so that makes me happy. I end up finding a Berserker Axe as well. It's a Death Cleaver. And I find a Diadem, which of course is everybody's favorite, Griffin's Eye. And here it is, Legendary Mallet number five. And I find Ogre Gauntlets, these are also very rare, but 185 strength made them kind of weird. Second Giant Trasher, just more trash. I end up finding a Dusk Shroud with plus 3 to Enchant, which is a plus 3 skill armor for a build that might actually use it, which is cool. And this is Grayler number 3 for me, so this is a Raven Lore, I did not have one of those yet. Second Dimensional Shard. It's another Death Fathom. I believe this is better than the first one. And I find another Lich one. It's a very rare item and now I have three of them. So that's a Scourge. It's a Horizons Tornado. Second Cryptic Axe and the Griswold Armor, but nobody cares about that. And is this one three sockets? Nope, it is not. Mwah, mwah, mwah. And there is a grey berserker axe on the ground. It's an ethereal one. Guess what this ended up being? Hint, you can see it in the summon bob video. And I end up finding one of my favorite items, an ethereal quarter step. It's an ethereal rib cracker. This is one of the sickest items for the truth. Oh, also a third my house. And I find the second berserker axe because barbarians like assassins have two arms. So it's another death cleaver. And with that, I did almost 3000 Ontario runs, thank you for watching, see you in the next one, bye bye.